Luke from Sticky here. I'm here to talk to you about my stapler collection here today. I've dragged it out from the shed. And I got it out on the backyard table here. I've kind of just acquired all these things over the past few years. I, use, I do use most of them. Down this end though are the ones that I use the most. This here is... The Rexel Pulsar with um, Power Ease One Finger Technology. I got some um, RSI in my wrist last year from using um, staplers like this a little bit too much. This is um, it's just a Marbig. I'm not sure what what, um, what model it is, but it's nice. But I just it uses a lot less wrist force than one of them One Finger actions. So with the long arm stapler. This one here is the Paper Pro One Finger Action. Um, I ended up getting that one from America. Couldn't find any in Australia at the time, and got my friend Dave Roach to uh, mail me one over from the U.S. Other here down this end, we have a very small um, stapler stapler from Japan, which is a nice, nice little one to use. Just makes a hole in the paper and wraps the um, paper around to make a staple in technique and then down the back we have the Romelang 17 all the way from Italy which I use for much much bigger zines the Paper Pro here will do up to 25 sheets usually but the Romelang you can do up to 140 with this beast here other ones of interest is this Max Swing Action from Japan this was introduced to me by the man they call Staples in Brisbane. It starts off as just a regular stapler and then you can swing it around like so. So it turns into a long arm stapler. And then if you're in the mood for doing some really crazy type stapling, here is my one and only duck stapler. <laughs> now get to work! <laughs>